Homes along Dallas Street in Modesto have a beautiful view of the Tuolumne River, but discovered along the bank of the river in recent weeks are caves that people were living in. Yes, there's people living there, and um, I've known about those for like the last 10 years. The city of Modesto says it partnered with Operation 9 to 99, a local volunteer group to clean up the caves. Over the weekend, they warned those living in the caves to leave and offered services to them before removing a total of 7,600 pounds of trash, as well as two truckloads and a trailer of garbage. But a woman who says she used to be homeless tells us there are more caves just like these along the river elsewhere. The caves that are here now that they're cleaned out so far this year, there's more caves along the river here. Yeah, there is. And there's other spots where people live, too. Like, there's a lot, a lot of people stay down there, but it's dangerous because the water comes up and people don't know when they're going to open the dam. Residents with homes in the area say they, too, have safety concerns like the caves flooding and collapsing, but they're not surprised to find out about the caves because they knew something was up for a while. We saw people going in and out, and it was usually about the same group of individuals that would constantly be in and out. And we were concerned because we were like, they're coming up and down our neighborhood and they're looking in our garages. And, you know, so we were concerned and then, but we didn't know where they were staying. I think they were smart and did it at night. Um, Cause yeah, we didn't see the movement, that kind of movement. This is the embankment where those caves have been dug out. And this is one of those caves right here, easily big enough to fit a bed. In a statement, the city of Modesto says, quote, the city recognizes the importance of not only addressing the immediate safety risks, but also working towards a comprehensive solution to permanently eliminate these caves. Our commitment is to navigate this situation with diligence, taking into account the structural safety of the surrounding areas, end quote. Residents hope the city gets this handled soon. I think they got to fill them in. That's the first step. Uh, we can't just keep them sitting there because that's just going to bring them back and it's going to bring the, the risks back. Zach Boweto, Fox 40 News.